Well, good afternoon, buyers. How's everyone feeling? Nervous? Excited? I can certainly share in those emotions with you here today. On behalf of the vendor, we welcome you here to the auction of number seven, Vintage Grove, here in the heart of Churnside Park. My name is Kenny Oliver, and I have a pleasure to be your auctioneer today. And joining me as always is George Giorgio and Charles Cardi, and they'll be here to assist with any questions you may have. And we proudly represent Hock and Stewart Bark. In a moment, I will commence the auction by referring to the prepared documentation. I'll then say a few words about this fantastic home we have on offer here today before I call on your spirit of bidding. And on that note, I do wish all buyers here today their best of luck with their competition. Of course, I need to remind you that the auction will be conducted in accordance with the rules and any additional conditions that were made available for inspection before the start of the auction. The auction rules prohibit an auctioneer from accepting bids or offers for a property before and does provide fines for this conduct. The rules do permit vendor bids. Uh, sorry, the, I lost my way here. The vendors have a reserve price and as the auctioneer, I will indicate bidders on request. The law prohibits false bids and prohibits major disruptions by bidders and prohibits and a uh, tap and Jesus. Start again. The law prohibits false bids and prohibits major disruptions by bidders and prohibits bidders attempted to prevent others from bidding and provides fines for this conduct. The rules do permit vendor bids and the words I'll use during the auction to indicate I'm making a bid on behalf of the vendor are simply those words vendor bid and by law only I as the auctioneer can make a vendor bid. Well the contractor sale has been on display for the past half an hour or so. I can see many familiar faces in the crowd here today. So I don't propose to read through the entire contracts, but I will make reference to that the land we are offering is described in the Certificate of Title Volume 10373 and, and Folio 235 and includes all improvements and fixtures, or as we all know the property to be, number seven, Vintage Grove, Churnside Park. The terms we're selling on here today, well, the price will shortly be ter determined by you buyers here today. Once the contract hits my hand, the property will be sold calling for a 10% standard deposit upon signing the contracts with the lucky purchaser and the balance due at the expiration of 30, 60 or 90 days. The vendor statement or section 32, as it's also known, has been on display alongside the contractor sale and this declares all information to the buyers here today. And you'll note within those documents, we're in a residential one zone, the highest and best form of ownership in the state of Victoria. Well, before I go on with the proceedings, are there any questions in relation to the documentation or the auction here today? No questions? Very good. Sure. Could you tell me when the final inspection was completed? The final inspection, I believe, it was 2006, ma'am. Is that on the swimming pool you're referring to? Yeah, it was all ticked off, all approved back in 2006. So you bid here today of confidence. Thank you for your question. Sure. You've been quoting a range here today. Will the reserve price be in that range? Uh, the reserve price will be in that range today, sir. I can tell you that with confidence. Thank you. So you can bid on that basis. Thank you for the question. Well, lots of questions means lots of interest, buyers. And I'm not surprised, but what a wonderful home we have an offer here today. The lifestyle and location with this home is second to none. We have a fantastic countryside feel here in the heart of Churnside Park. The gateway to the Yarra Valley, home to Victoria's most famous wine region. Beautiful valleys, parklands, and when you take that breath in, you can taste that crisp, fresh air, which makes you feel like you're on a holiday away with the family. And buyers, you're lucky enough to have all this, plus everything which Melbourne is known for, with major shopping centres nearby, the famous Churnside Shopping Centre, only two minutes drive which hosts all the major retailers and brands at your disposal. The best private and state schools, quality cafe and restaurants, and all this, less than 40 minutes to the CBD. Vintage Grove is the best address in town, ladies and gentlemen, and you will not be disappointed when you walk through the property itself. Nestled here at the end of the street, overlooking the valley, we have four large bedrooms, two stunning bathrooms, three exceptional entertaining areas. And the polished boards throughout means you don't have to worry about cleaning those wine stains out of, uh, out of the carpet after your short visit to the gearing station. <laughs> and the deck. What a deck it is. A deck which you can sit back, enjoy the serenity, soak up those summer rays 
while splashing around in the newly built heated solar pool. Well, buyers would like to remind you this is a rare opportunity, a rare offering. These properties don't come up often here in the heart of Churnside Park. I urge you today to bid with confidence. If you need to go that extra step, push yourself to the limit, I suggest you do. Because you can look back in years to come and be proud and boast to your family and friends about how well you were, how well you bought rather, here in 2011. So buyers, I throw it over to you. What can I see here? An opening start anywhere, anywhere at all at number seven, Vintage Grove, here in the heart of Chernside Park. Start me where you will, I don't mind where you start me. An opening start. Generally your first bid won't buy it. Happy to be surprised. Come surprise me. Many familiar faces in the crowd. Buyers does require audience participation. An opening start anywhere at all. Been quoting the property six to six sixty. Perhaps a start around the six hundred mark, and I suggest. An open start anywhere at all. Well, buyers, I will place a vendor bid of 600000 and look for $10,000 rises anywhere at all. I'll give you 600. That's 600. That's 610? 600. Vendor bid is at 600000 600. The bid is at 600000 Takes 10000 to come back in, sir. 600000 vendor bid. I need to see 10. Can I see 10, sir? I'll give you 600. Bid's already 600000 I'd like to match that bid. Like to match that bid? Why not? I'll take it. That's 600,000 I have, looking for $10,000 rise than anywhere at all. That's 600,000 here, can I see a $10,000 rise, 610 I have now, welcome the bidding ma'am in the centre. That's 610,000 here, 10 more. That's 620 I have, welcome sir, on my right, fairly bid at 620, against you ma'am, looking for $10,000 rise. That's 620,000 here on my right, fairly bid. 620,000 here, looking for $10,000 rise anywhere at all. We all done, all silent, not, surely not at this level ladies and gentlemen. Should be a Mexican wave. That's 620,000 I have. Why not? I'll take your five. That's 625 I have now. Same more. opportunity. Welcome, sir. It's 630. That's 630,000 I have at the back against you, ma'am, and against you, sir, earlier. That's 625,000 I have. 625, looking for $5,000 rise anywhere at all. Ma'am, show your strength. Put the confidence in your bidding. Come with me for five. Can't be fairer than that at this level. That's 625. Can I say 30? Yes? No? Maybe? Two and a half, why not? That's 627 and a half I have here against you, sir. Can I say 30? That's 627 and a half here. I'll call it down three times. First time of calling at 627 and a half. Yep. 630 I have now. Welcome back, sir, at 630. That's 630,000 at the front here against you, ma'am. Another two and a half if you like. Put the pressure back on. That's 630 here. The bid's against you. Make no mistake. That's 630,000. Look for two and a half thousand dollar rises anywhere at all. That's 630 here. 630,000 is the bid. Fairly bid. Two and a half. Welcome back. That's 632,500 against you, sir. Sir, 35. Come with me for two and a half. Two. Let's keep it in whole numbers. Why not? I'll take you two. That's 634 and a half. That's 64 and a, 634 and a half. Ma'am, two and a half perhaps. How about a knockout punch of 40? Could get in there. We're the so we're dealing with the, the highest bidder. It's currently this gentleman here. That's 634,500. Put yourself in the box position, sir. How about you come with me for two and a half? That's 634,500. Why not? I'll take you 1,500. That's 636 I have. That's 636 with the lady at my centre, 636,000. Against you, sir. How about round me out the 40? Could be a great bit of that level. Give you two. Why not? I'll take you two. That's 638,000. Same opportunity to you, ma'am. 40 I have now. That's 640,000 I have. Are we all done? All signed at this level? Surely not at 640,000. I'll call it down three times. First time. Second, third, final call at 640,000. Sir, you with me for another two? You sure? All done? At 640,000, the bid is at the centre. Buyers in the heart of Chernside Park. Rare opportunity, rare offering. This is your chance. Pull those hands out of your pockets. Make a few bids. This is your opportunity at 640,000. Fairly bid at the centre with this lady. Why not? I'll take your thousand, sir. That's 641,000. Welcome back on my right. 643 I have now. 643 at the back against you, sir. 644. 644, 646, 647. How about some bring up the 50? 50, can I say? 50 I have. 48. Yeah, confirm your bid, ma'am. Two more. 50 I have. We eventually got there. That's 650,000 I have at the back here on the left. 652. 652 I have at the centre. Can I say 55 anywhere at all? 
That's 652. I'll call it down three times. First, second. 1,000. Why not? I'll take you one. That's 653 I have. 653, can I say 55 anywhere at all? I'll still take you one man if that makes it a little bit easier. It's 654. One and a half. 654, one and a half. That's 655 and a half. 655 and a half. And make no mistake, ladies and gentlemen, we're selling. That's 655,500. It's against you, ma'am, and against you, sir, at the back there, and against you early at the front. That's 655,500. We all done? All silent? Surely not. I'll call it down three times. First time we're calling it 656 and a half. Welcome back. That's 656,500 against you, sir. Sir, you resolve this by this property. Seriously being tested here. Come with me for 500. Can't be fairer than that. Or a knockout punch at 60 if you like. Not going to miss it at that level. That's 656,500 with the lady in the centre. It's 656,500. Looking for 500 dollar rise anywhere at all. Two and a half. Two and a half. Great bid there, sir. That's 669,000 we have. That 659,000 rather. 659,000 here, the bid is. Fairly bid against you, ma'am. That's 659,000. Can someone round me up to 60 anywhere at all? 60 I have. Welcome back, sir, at the back. That's 60, 63, half. nearly had her. That's 63, half, 63 and a half. At 663,500 I have here. Confirm your bid, sir. That's 663,500 on my right. Against you, sir. Against you, ma'am. That's 663,500. Looking for 500 dollar rise anywhere at all. Make no mistake, we're selling. There'll be no late bids, no late offers. This is your time to join in, ladies and gentlemen, because we're selling if there's no further bids. That's 663,500. Fairly bid on my right. I saw that one first. That's 664,000. Sorry, ma'am. That's 664,000. Like to bid again. Take your 500 now if you like. That's 664,000 on my left. Looking for 500 dollar rise, sir. Can I see another one? So ask yourself the question. That was his last bid. Would you bid again? If you knew that 100%. That's 664,000. 1,000? 665 I have. 665 and a half. Nearly had her. That's 665 and a half. Can I see a 500? That's 665 and a half I have, it's against you. Can I see another 500, sir? I'll call it down three times. First, second, third. Final call, it's 665,500 with the ladies in the centre. Against you, sir. Another 500, you're going to miss it. Are you with me? 1,000? 666 and a half. That's 666,500. It's a tricky number to say, isn't it? That's 666,500. How about you? Round me up to 70, ma'am. Put me at ease. That's 666,500. The bid's against you. And against you, sir, at the back. You sure you're all done? I appreciate your competition here today. That's 666,500. All done. All silent. Ma'am, you with me? 500. That's 667. Oh, glad we're off that number. That's 667 I have now. Looking for 500 dollar rise anywhere at all. Sir, it's against you. How about a knockout bid at 70? Can't be fairer than that. Done. Be a great bid. Could get her. For your opportunity, look back in a few years. If you're reaping the wards. At 667,500, I'll call it down three times. The first time I call it at 667,000. The second time I call it at 667,000. All done. All silent. Sir, with me? You sure? Appreciate your competition. At 667,500. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll be selling if there's no further bids. Be no late offers. No late bids. Once the contract hits my hand, the property will be sold. We're selling. We're selling. Sold, and congratulations to the purchaser. <laughs> My name is Kenny Oliver, and I look forward to seeing you all soon at the next successful Hockey Stewart Rule Bark Auction. Have a great day.